Hi guys, welcome back to another budget guitar show. Now, originally this video was going to be all about this. My Harley Benton DC Junior in TV yellow. Now, a friend of mine has had this now for a good few months and um, he thinks it's an absolutely fantastic guitar. And I was a little indifferent to it. So I was gonna do a video to see if I still did really like this guitar or whether it was just going to be the piece of wall art to go up the back there with my other collections of um, guitars based on the guitars owned by my favourite guitarists. Now this one as you can see has been modded to be a Johnny Thunders style for those of you who don't know who Johnny Thunders is go and check out his music and the New York Dolls um, but he always played a TV yellow Gibson Jr um, as you can see I've had the Gibson decal put on um, and the headstock has been reshaped um, this is not to confuse anyone this is just because I wanted something that looked accurate without having to shell out again on a DC Jr by Gibson so when I started doing this video I thought I'll whack it through a couple of pedals from the new Faisley range and before everybody out there starts saying come on Johnny you're boring us now with all of these pedals I found the perfect perfect distortion pedal and we're going to take a look at it on this channel right now and we're also going to be testing it out with this but we're also going to be testing it out with a double humbucker guitar just to see what kind of sounds we get and we're going to pair it up as well with the chorus Chrissy. so let's get into it right now guys so as you can see from the picture on screen um, this is vintage vicky and it is an analog distortion pedal so you see we have a normal setting a turbo setting and a solo setting you have a volume and a filter setting you have your gain control and your little foot switch so let's plug this in right now and get some sounds going through those using the junior okay so everything is sort of in the middle position and we're on the normal setting so let's see what we get out of the junior <laughs> I thought that sounded really rather good I liked the sort of tones I was getting out of that so uh, I'm now going to just up the gain slightly and see what we get here <laughs> And so as we heard there I thought that sounded brilliant with this guitar so now let's put the game back down to the middle position and uh, we'll go into the next setting on the pedal okay so now we're in the turbo setting on the pedal so let's see what we get out of the turbo <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, and now we are going to go into the solo setting on the pedal and see what we get right now. So, what did I think of this guitar while I was playing with that pedal? Well, I really did like what was being pushed out there. Um, this, when I got it back, I just had to adjust the truss rod and uh, do a little bit on the intonation. And uh, now... To me, it plays and feels like a fantastic guitar. The guitar that I should have had when I originally bought it um, two, maybe three years ago. So I'm really, really happy with this guitar right now. Um, I think it sounds great. And the tones that that pedal was pushing out with just this single coil P90 were amazing that that is the kind of game that i like um i'm 100 percent definitely going to be buying one of these pedals anyway now let's hook it up with a humbucker guitar and uh we'll add in chorus chrissy and see how she sounds and as you can see for this test i've chosen to use my steve jones epiphone copy and uh we're gonna quickly do a little run through on the vintage Vicky uh, on those three settings and see how she handles and then we're going to bring in chorus Chrissy. <laughs> Well, as you can hear there, I thought that sounded an absolute treat. Uh, this is why I say that vintage Vicky pedal for uh, £21.30 on the Bax website. It's definitely worth a look. If you want to check it out for yourself, there's a link down below in the description. Go and click on that and check it out for yourself. All I know is, is I'm buying one. Now we're going to whack on some of Chorus Chrissy and uh, see what kind of sounds we get from that now everything at the moment is in the middle position uh, and we'll just do the same thing we'll flip through that with the vintage vicky in effect <laughs>
and so there we go guys now what i took from that is that that vintage vicky pedal for 21 pounds 30 pence is a fantastic little piece of kit um as i said previously i'm definitely buying one the chorus chrissy yeah uh definitely if you hold it back slightly and not have anything too full on i think that is another great pedal and that is 21 pounds 30 also on the back's website links are down below now the guitar yeah i really liked playing that les paul jr copy from harley benton again um i'm happy with that guitar now uh with the things that i've done to it just to make it a bit more playable i'm so so happy with it so guys thank you very much for watching the show today thank you very much to our backers and our patrons who are there and if you want to watch another video from this channel there's one right here other than that stay safe stay sane and keep on rocking <laughs>